My name is the Mighty Beard, and we are back here once again for another episode of Civilization VI. We are playing as Canada, and we are going for a culture victory uh, so far at, tier, at turn 240. Uh, we're leading. We're leading. Uh, things could get better, though. I feel like we're going at a super slow pace, and we should probably try to pick up steam this era. This era being the modern era. One where we have a golden age. So, uh, yeah, we'll start off deciding on our dedication. As far as what dedication to choose from, I think I'd like to go with the uh, Heartbeat of Steam. It gives us 10% production towards Industrial Era and Later Wonders. Uh, the Campus District's uh, Science Adjacency Bonus provides production. Uh, we do have some campuses now, and we should have at least one or two more uh, coming up this era, so getting some production from that as well would be would be super nice. Uh, so yeah, I think that's the route we're going to take. I think we are going to go towards promoting uh, Pingala, um, since we have an available governor title. So I think we're going to go for the grants, which gives us 100% great people points generated per turn in the city. I do like this one as well, 100% tourism with great works of art. Music and writing. Uh, we do have some of that too, so we might as well. Yeah, we'll just we'll just use all of our promotions. <laughs> it's okay. We'll, we'll we'll get more as we go. Uh, we do have a settler, and I think again we'd like to uh, start start heading up in this direction and maybe settle uh, close to close to this region again. Uh, having a a national park over in this area would be would be swell. And since we're already taking the bonus for uh, production of wonders, I think we're going to move in skyscrapers uh, just because that will give us another 15% bonus towards all wonders. And soon enough, as far as great people goes, we will have a great writer, artist, and musician, uh, which is very good. It looks like we'll probably miss out on uh, the engineer. But if we can snag it once it, it drops down just a little bit uh, in faith, that would be pleasant. And as far as wonders, I think I want to start with the Hermitage. It'll give us plus four great work uh, works of art slots. Uh, I'm putting it right here on top of the marsh. Um, I think is going to be our best bet. Um, and we will also queue up the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> Again, uh, Statue of Liberty as plus four diplomatic victory points and then all cities within six tiles which i think is just this one uh will will gain uh will gain a little bit of uh 100 loyalty colossus would be pretty cool too only because it uh is a plus three gold um but it grants a it grants a trader unit and trader units are always good, but for, for now, we'll, we'll go for the Statue of Liberty just because that's going to take uh, the longest to achieve. All right, we did earn a great musician, so we'll go ahead and recruit him. Okay, and as far as our settler, I'm thinking I want to go right, right about here because we can go ahead and place uh, another ice rink right here and then maybe a theater district somewhere in, you know, in between these two blocks. And Australia would like some niter, all of our niter, but uh, we should be producing more. Uh, so that's no big deal, but uh, is willing to give us uh, one gold and one gold for 30 turns. Um, and open borders, eh, it's, not, it's not bad, it's not bad. Uh, will you give us anything else? Pearls, uh, how about elephants? No. All right, well, we'll take it just, uh, just to be nice and hopefully get on his good side. And we are going to go ahead and buy... Buy a bunch of tiles, so we want pretty much all of the, the mountain over here. Um, probably take that one too. And then we want this tile right here just for the uh, just for the tundra. Okay, we also just uh, recruited a new writer. So we'll go ahead and take that. Uh, we can't really use it right now. Also, um, our builder and scout were just taken out uh, by a barb. Uh, yeah, it's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Okay, the Bolshoi Theater is now up, looking good. And our expression of cultural heritage will define humanity's future in the atomic era. So that's, uh, yeah, we've completed the first World Civic and the new era of discovery. Very good. 
Our knowledge of flight has advanced as well. 100% tourism from uh, great works of art and artifacts. Oh, I like that. I think I kind of want that more than musicians at this point, because we can't really use music, uh, musicians until we get a broadcast center. So uh, for now, we'll go with that. Okay, and it looks like we've got a few a few shipwrecks uh, near town. So um, yeah, as soon as we can uh, produce an archaeologist, we'll be uh, we'll be good to go. Uh, so we'll go ahead and get a few in the queue, just because we've got a lot of antiquity sites around, uh, as well as shipwrecks. So yeah, we'll get a bunch, and we actually really should be producing spies. Looks like we can get spies at uh, fourteen. Uh, 14 turns here in Halifax, so yeah, we'll queue up a few there. Ooh, actually, nine turns, um, nine turns in Ottawa, but we're going to be working on the, uh, the Hermitage, which will take 38 turns. Oh, 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 okay, we can also queue up, uh, the Sydney Opera House. Is there, is there another location where that can go? It's got to be adjacent to a harbor. Currently, that's the only place we can go. We can go with it. So let's go ahead and queue it up here. Uh, and actually, we can't queue it up here. It's got to be adjacent to a harbor. Uh, but that's where we're going to go with the other one, the Statue of Liberty. Um, so, yeah, I know we were working on a campus. Um, maybe we should maybe we should hold off and, and put a harbor in here instead. Okay, the Great Engineer, we can go ahead and, and purchase for Faith, seven, uh, 705 Faith. Uh, that is that is wonderful. Uh, so grants uh, 480 production towards a wonder construction. So we'll actually uh, move him over into uh, Kingston once we once we get that started. All right. So our Mountie is a uh, modern light cavalry, and I was really hoping we would have uh, some production for for that. We've got. Uh, industrial era, uh, industrial era, <laughs> ancient and classical, but nothing related to modern. That's disappointing. But we'll go ahead and throw up an ice rink. Okay, so this engineer, we're just going to kind of sit here uh, for the foreseeable future because, again, like as soon as we get this Mountie done, and actually, I'm thinking we should probably, uh, we should probably move the Statue of Liberty up uh quite a bit 1240 production but if we go ahead and move our great engineer uh can can help uh produce that a bit faster uh we'll also come over here to chop out this wood and help to speed up this guy okay wonderful so uh, we've got our ancient walls now we can go ahead so i think we're gonna go f ahead now to uh, build a commercial hub here in montreal I mean, more gold is always better. All right, so let's go ahead and use this 480. That takes uh, about 20 turns off. Very good. And he should have uh, two more charges left. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Statue of Liberty. There we go. Statue of Liberty has been built. And so now we're up to nine tourism, which is pretty good, as well as nine diplomatic points. So, uh, yeah, only only 11 more to go. <laughs> if, if, if we're going to go for a, di uh, uh, a diplomatic victory. Now, again, one thing we should be worried about, or at least uh, mindful of, is Catholicism currently is, uh, is pretty dominant. They've got to they've gotta get across uh, across the ocean um we'll see we'll see we'll keep our eye on that okay and in vancouver we've got a plus three uh theater square right there so we'll go ahead and take that that farm out that's no big deal another fishery and a farm and then we've got this engineer so um i think we'll send it to um, I think we'll send it over to Hamilton, uh, just because after, uh, after we get this harbor done, we'll go ahead and build the Sydney Opera House. And our friendship has expired with Brazil, so we will, we will go ahead and rekindle 
rekindle our alliance. Okay, another great artist. Go ahead and pick that up. And we can send that artist over to this amphitheater. And hopefully we'll have some more amphitheaters soon. Because <laughs> we're, we're starting to run out of room. And we can actually send our musician over to uh, the Boy Soil uh, Theater. Bolshoi. Bolshoi Theater. Very good. So we've got at least that. Uh, so yeah, now we have a, uh, a piece of music here. We can also uh, we uh, we can also send one of our writers over and uh, get uh, get another writing in there to to fill that place up. Okay, so we filled up uh, the Bolshoi Theater. Uh, so yeah, we've increased tourism quite uh, quite a bit. Very good, very good. And we'll add another great work to the uh, to the art museum or the amphitheater rather. No, the art museum. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, okay. So, theming wise, um, I think we need works done in the same uh, period, but it can't be the same artist. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, it's the same. Uh, it's it's art of the same type by different artists or artifacts of the same era from different civilizations. So we would need three sculptures here, three sculptures here, but all made by uh, different people. Uh, three paintings, all made by different people, etc., etc. Okay, it looks like we can go ahead and build out the Ferris wheel. Uh, so we'll we'll give that a go. That'll boost uh, tourism plus two. It's pretty good. Okay, so we'll and the Dutch would like to make us a deal. They'd like four of our oil for twenty of their uranium and gold. Will you add aluminum? No. No, you won't. Okay. Well, um, I'm okay with this. Sounds good. As long as you don't attack us. <laughs> All right. We got a first Mountie plus four. Awesome. And I think what I'd like to do with, uh, with our engineers, I'm going to bring the engineer back, uh, cause we are in the process of, of building the Patala palace. Uh, so yeah, bringing, uh, bringing him over. He would be great. Okay. So for our first Mountie, we've got some spots here that we can go ahead and uh, turn into national park. So we'll go ahead and do just that. All right. So the uh, World Congress is now in session and we kind of went all out here. So we're, we're spending 550 diplomatic points just because we had over a thousand. Uh, the first one, uh, chosen player generates 100% more grievances. Uh, we cho chose Patootie. I, I really don't know what's going on, but, um, you know, it's a free it's a free one. It doesn't cost us anything. So who knows? Uh, but then I voted five times for us to grow 20 uh, percent faster. Now, last time, I think the vote was like 15 votes for Patootie. Uh, so who knows? Who knows? But then 10 points for us to get two diplomatic victory points. So, again, 10 points, I hope. I hope that's enough. And we also voted for the World's Fair. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Great. All right. So 20% faster population. Uh, we gained two, two diplomatic victory points. And uh, yeah, the World's Fair passed. A lot of votes here. A lot of votes here. As far as the World's Fair goes, it's just about a matter of who is creating the most uh, great people point. So every time you generate a great people point per turn, uh, it is uh, it, it will give us some some score. So we'll just uh, we'll see how that plays out. But that earned us four diplomatic victory points, which is huge, huge. That gives us thirteen now. Okay, our mounty is in place. So let's go ahead and designate a natural park. Gives us plus four. Wonderful. And that should really benefit uh, us <laughs> in general. Uh, I mean, that that's going to add tourism, which is great. It's also going to receive two amenities. The four closest cities in your civilization receive one amenity. I mean, that's that's perfect. Our alliance with the Dutch is expired. So let's go ahead and uh, and get that alliance back up and running. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, use our engineer uh, to hopefully build out to Patala Palace. Ooh, okay, uh, definitely. I mean, that took thirty points down. That's that's pretty nice. 
<laughs> uh, so, uh, yeah, the Scythians uh, apparently possess blue jeans and rock music, and they're not afraid to use them. Uh, great. We'll get some rock bands over here. We've got another Mountie, so I think we'll we'll send that Mountie. Uh, we'll send him over here. And then this Mountie, I guess he only has that one charge. So uh, for now, he'll just go into a city and garrison it up. All right, so we've got a military slot that is opened up. So we're going to go ahead and throw uh, unit maintenance reduced by two gold per turn. Because right now we're losing 27 gold per uh, four for all of our units. Everything else will keep the same. All right, and we lost suzerainship of Zanzibar, so we're going to go ahead and snag that back because that uh, six amenity each is uh, is worth worth having. And we've got another Mountie, so I think for now, I mean, another Mountie would be good to come up up to the north, maybe. Um, so for now, we'll just sit him in this ice rink. Okay, so I don't know if this is a if this is a great idea. Um, actually, can we we buy some tiles? Maybe let's go ahead and buy this one, and then we'll buy this one as well. And can this Mountie go anywhere else? I kind of want to send the Mountie over here, only because um, you know we can settle you know a campus over here. You could probably take make use of uh, of, of this guy. Uh, this geothermal spot uh, soon here enough. So let's let's go ahead and bring him over here, and we'll hold off on this national park. Uh, another plus one for scientific theory. Very good. That unlocks the Oxford University, which has uh, two plus great works of writing slots, which would be fantastic. All right, and another national park right here. It's another three. Wow. Are we going to get error scores every single time we, we make a national park because that's fantastic i mean that one put us into a uh into a normal age <sighs> it'd be great to get another golden age but i think the normal age will have to do uh, just to kind of depends depends on what else can we can we can do uh this game yeah okay we only have 10 more turns so it's very very unlikely okay we can also pick up uh broadway in kingston and we've got an empty slot right here, so we might as well, might as well place it. Uh, so yeah, next turn that that that'll come, but that'll give us um, that will give us uh, a, a great uh, a writing slot, uh, two music slots. So uh, yeah, that's fantastic. And apparently, we are going to continue to fight for Zanzibar. <laughs> so let's just load it up. And this is why we don't use envoys, so that we can we can. We can load them up when when we need them, and I think we're gonna buy two tiles. Oh, it'd be great if we could use this as a uh, a national park. I mean, it is a diamond shape, but yeah, uh, it's, it's not gonna give it to us. I, I guess the appeal is probably bad. Oh, the appeal is okay. Maybe uh, next one probably could go over in this in this region. Oh, I take that back. I had the the wrong one selected. So yeah, let's just go ahead and bring this guy down, uh, and we'll we'll get another national park going. That's great. That's a great use of that land. All right, so gunboat diplomacy is pretty good because it gives us uh, open borders with all city states, but it also gives us plus four influence points per turn. So when we're going to need to send more envoys out. And we're running low. This would be uh, the policy to pick up. For now, though, I think we're going to move up uh, the 100% tourism uh, towards great works of art. And then we're going to bring down uh, the plus two great artist points. As far as our diplomatic slot goes, maybe we'll go ahead and do that. I mean... Uh, Having that plus two culture from uh, from our city states that are, that we're suzerains of is is pretty good too. And should note that uh, as far as the World's Fair goes, we've got 17 turns. We're about 150, uh, 130 behind uh, Pachuti right now. So uh, those extra points for uh, great people is 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 going to be very beneficial. 
Okay, let's go ahead and designate a new national park. Another plus three. Perfect. Five turns. Ten more points to go. I, I don't. I don't think it's gonna happen. Yeah, and I think uh, there's nothing else gonna be coming out of production soon, so we're just gonna be. Actually, we will get uh, the Patala Palace this next turn. Oh man, we had one turn left with the Patala Palace, and some <laughs> someone took it right from underneath us. Oh, that is awful. But shooty. Oh, uh, yeah, that's really unfortunate because that would have given us a diplomatic policy slot, a uh, victory point. Probably would have been plus two or three error score. Uh, that's so sad. So anyways, we've got a spy. Um, I feel like we should send the spy uh, down to uh, the Incas just to uh, get an idea of what, what they've got going on. All right, so looking around of where to send the spy... Um, no one has uh, a great great work. There's a few people with the relics, but I don't think we can we can steal those. So um, instead, um, I I I think we're just going to counter spy. So yeah, we'll just we'll just protect uh, we'll just protect our own our own place right now. You got a great person though. Another great rider. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. And because of that, uh, I think I'm going to delay uh, our next spy. And maybe we go maybe we go for a trader instead, because uh, increasing our trade capacity would be good. Zanzibar, again, they're just one up in us every time. But that will end the modern era. We now are entering into the atomic era. We just unlocked industrialization, which will give us a bit of power. Uh, we've also got sources of coal yeah, all over the place. So we should be, yeah, we're already pulling in coal, which is, uh, which is great. We'll get another uh, promotion for our secret society. And uh, yeah, uh, sort of productive, I guess. Maybe productive isn't the right word for Canada. <laughs> uh, but, you know, we got some Mounties. We went ahead. And we set up a bunch of uh, national parks. Uh, and we now have a victory in 146 turns. So two more episodes, unless we can speed it up somehow. I don't know. I guess I guess we'll find out. But that's it. My name is Mighty Beard. It's been a pleasure. And we will play Civilization VI again very soon. Later.